Hi, I'm Arlen, and I'm excited to share a brand new feature in Storyline 360, the Modern Player. What we call the player are all the parts of your course that are not on a slide. For example, controls like the Next and Previous buttons, the Play and Pause button, and the Seek bar. The player also includes tabs like the Menu, Glossary, and Notes. These control and player elements are a big part of your learner's experience with your course. We're introducing this new modern player that lets you deliver a beautiful, consistent experience across every device. Notice how the player responds to various device sizes and orientations. You'll also notice that the slide scales to use all available space, giving your slide content focus. Our goal for the new player was for the controls to melt into the background, letting your content shine. Okay, next let's look at all the ways you can customize the modern player. You control all of the features and settings here in Player Settings, and you can select which player to use here in the ribbon. The modern player is used by default for all new projects, but we kept the classic player too, just in case you need it. You can also choose to hide menus and controls. In that case, the only thing that will display is your slide. This is especially useful if you want to build custom navigation elements. I'm going to leave the default menus and controls on. You've got a bunch of options to customize the look of the modern player. The modern player comes with both a dark and a light theme to suit your needs. You can also choose a custom accent color. And you can choose what fonts the player uses and adjust their size. You can specify navigation button styles. The default setting is icon only, and you can change that to icon in text or just text. Using the new modern player gives your learner the best experience on every device. Enjoy!